after the match, I asked Shafrin Rutherford about that innings he played in Australia. I asked Rutherford how that innings when he came to the crease with West Indies 79 for 5 against Australia at Perth. And he and Russell put on that partnership of over 100 to propel West Indies to 200, over 200 in that match at Perth, which West Indies eventually won. I asked Rutherford how that experience prepared him for this innings. This was Rutherford's reply. You know, the innings in Australia is one that, you know, I kept close to me. And, you know, even though, you know, it was a good innings, I tried to pick a few things out of it. And I think one of the few things was, you know, give myself time. Um, it's, it's, a, it's always a process. And, you know, something when you look too far ahead, you can actually forget about the process. So for me, it was just, you know, ball after ball, you know, give myself time, run singles, get myself ready so that in the back end, I can always make up. There are a number of persons who believe that T20 cricket is all about bashing the ball over the place. This track or the tracks that we are seeing, the pitches that we are seeing in the West Indies, it calls for batsmanship. It doesn't call, it's not, they are not roads. They do not call for yours mainly to be just swinging through the line and clearing the boundaries. These pitches are going to test the metal of the batsman. And Rutherford said it. I have to be patient. I have to realize that I have more time than, it, than is necessary. Taking it one delivery at a time. He had to bat deep. It calls up on his batting skill. Some skill that players who we have been calling for cannot demonstrate. And have not yet demonstrated. But Russell, but Rutherford was at his absolute best. As he said in that clip, I learned from that innings is in Australia. It is something that I take with me. There are few points from it that I am always having with me. And Rutherford came to the party on Wednesday night for the West Indies.